All right, you guys, the Canon QL17 G3. What an amazing little camera. I have a lot to say, so let's just go ahead and jump in and get started. Now, the first thing that I noticed about this camera was the weight. It's not that big. The camera is, you know, a fairly small camera compared to other cameras, but it has heft to it. It feels like it was solidly built. I mean, it is a metal body. Uh, there are plastic components around here and there, just like the uh, film advanced lever, but overall, most of it is metal. The aperture and shutter speed rings are up in the front, just like you have them on the Olympuses. Uh, this one goes from bulb all the way up to 1 500ths of a second. Uh, also stops down from 1.7 all the way up to f16. And so you get that versatility to go ahead and make some nice shots. Uh, you also have a self timer on here and you have an A mode, which is I think shutter priority. Yeah, uh, the QL17 has shutter priority. It is powered by a battery, but you do not need a battery to operate the camera. The battery only will operate for the light meter and so if you want to shoot it in sunny 16 or you want to meet it for yourself off camera you can go ahead and do so and that's one of the things that i love about this thing it's not a battery dependent camera now the ql17 g3 has a 40 millimeter 1.7 lens and overall i was pretty skeptical when we first started shooting this thing uh, just because it kind of looks and it feels just like a normal compact rangefinder camera and so I didn't really have high expectations coming into it. I knew that a lot of people raved about it but I kind of just thought you know it was just one of those cameras and boy was I wrong. As you guys seen in those POVs I shot some Tri-X and some HP5. Mostly those shots are so we're tri uh, I'm sorry HP5 but it produced some quality images even stopped down to 1.7. You have decent shallow depth of field coming out of this guy right here and when you stop down from 5.6 to f8 maybe even f11 there's sharpness all across the frame and so it's an absolutely beautiful lens and I get it now. I get why all these people were talking about it. It's an awesome camera with an awesome lens and it just works. Now this camera surprised me for a number of reasons. One, because I never thought I'd like rangefinders, but after shooting this, I'm starting to. And that's kind of scary because it makes me want to venture off into Leicas, into Voigtlanders and stuff like that. And so this right here, is my starting point for my love for rangefinders. Another thing that surprised me was how quiet the camera is. It has a shutter that I believe they call it a leaf shutter. And so it's super silent. Like listen to this really quick. That's it, that's all it is. And so it makes it an ideal street photography camera or maybe a camera that you can take out to take candid shots of your family without them knowing, you know what I mean? And so, so it's just such a solid performer, nice big viewfinder, uh, very bright as well. The rangefinder patch, you know, it's fairly small, but it's average, it's bigger than the XA's rangefinder patch. And overall, I really enjoyed shooting this thing. I'm gonna go ahead and put the Canon QL17 G3 on one of my top 10 cameras for 2017, and actually of all time. I absolutely love this camera, and I'm definitely gonna keep this in my collection. So yeah, th that, those are my first impressions on the camera. I mean, there's nothing more you could ask for in it. If you are a street photographer, or maybe you're a casual shooter, or maybe you even travel, this is the perfect companion for traveling. I can see somebody taking this thing and using it daily for the whole entire year, and you guys will not regret it. There's a lot to be discovered about it. There's a lot to learn as well. But once you get the hang of it, and once you figure it out, you are gonna be set. This is such a solid camera, and I highly recommend it, you guys. I highly, highly, highly recommend this camera. All right, guys, so that's pretty much going to wrap it up for this video. Canon QL17 G3, an awesome camera. If you guys enjoyed it, drop a like down below. Also, comment if you guys have ever shot it, and maybe if you guys have any experience on the camera. Maybe I missed out something. You guys can go ahead and comment down below. As always, it's been King Japes. Till next time.